Right. One one draw away to Barrow. What's your take on that one? Yeah, I thought it was a good overall performance in this first half. The performance probably warranted to come in two or three nil up. Um, we're in control, create some great chances. Um, probably need to be a little bit more ruthless uh, in front of goal. Um, and then they had a 15 minute period and there's a couple of big decisions. One where Elliot's got bundled off the ball and hasn't been given the gun up to score, which um, baffled me a little bit. Um, but I think in any game, a team's going to have a period where they're on top. Sometimes it's that second half when the team's been dominated, the home team, they're going to come out with a response um, and they got back in it. And then we wrestled control again and just couldn't quite find that winner. But I think all in all, that what we've asked the lads to do that this week is readdress the balance of our, our game. I thought they did really well. You've mentioned that full week on the training pitch. And how much did you see of that out on the pitch today? No, I'm very pleased. You know, it's adding some ingredients to, to last week, but maintaining the quality we showed because you know I said to the lads on Friday that you know as much as we are disappointed with losing goals that some of the football we're playing some of the chance we've played has been outstanding. You know, it's been at a high level um, and you know top scorers in, in all divisions up to today um, is, is a credit to that. However, we know that there was areas we need to get better in and I think in the main we addressed that today. The fact that it was, as you said, a, half, a first half where we were on top, that must be pleasing after what had happened in the first half last weekend. Yeah, cause it was a, listen, a strong performance from us. I'm just disappointed we, we didn't take a couple of those chances because there was some real guilt edge opportunities for us. Um, and obviously, you know, 1 0 gives them hope. Um, and they've got some good players, we know that. This, this is, as everyone knows, a difficult, can be a difficult environment to come into. Um, but all in all, you know, I'd love to have got the three, but I thought um, there's a lot of. Um, Positives in the performance today. So, what do you do now? Two to into three points next time out. Uh, it's not in the league anyway. Well, just what I've said that you'd be a bit more clinical. Um, you know, I don't think the ref helped us. I've got to be honest with you. In that first 15 minute period, I'm not sure what happened at half time. I think it was the fact that they made a big song and dance about the penalty decision because there was something different at the start of the second half. I think everybody could see that. There was two, the, the Elliot Lee one, and then Tom O'Connor when he was driving through and got bundled off the ball for the ref to, to wave play on is um, um, yeah it was a bit surprising but listen you've got to deal with that and I thought we came through that period and I felt we'd go and get the winner but we just couldn't find that such a quality. And how do you now address this how do you work going forward into the Carabao Cup game on Tuesday night? Um, yeah we just um, you know, regroup again and um, pick a team uh, which we feel can uh, get through to the next round. Thanks Phil.